Okay, day six. We did not film up at the campsite. It was one hell of a night. It rained all night long, poured. Poor Pete had to go out there and hang the bear bags in oh, the poor Pete. rain. <laughs> well, we got we got in just in time before the real heavy rain started, but uh, it got cold. This has been our really first really cold night, probably yeah. close to freezing. You know, when we got up this morning, still a little rain, a lot of wind up there, so we packed up as fast as we could to get off the top of the mountain, start moving to get warm. And, uh, yeah, we didn't film up there because it was too wet and windy. Yeah, and this is what we're hiking in now, going downhill. It's wonderful now. We're out of that wind. Oh, I mean, yeah, this is wonderful. It, it was bad. <laughs> My fingers were going numb. It was horrible. We'll show you where we're going on the map later on because, quite frankly, we don't know yet today. And we got up an hour later. Yeah. It's only 8 o'clock, but it's late for us Nothing for a start. Nothing like pooping in the woods in a cold, driving rain. Yeah, there Can't you go. Can't beat it. You guys are missing out. This is really pretty. It's like a bright lime green moss lying in our trail. We're at 7.44 miles. Pete's hanging out at Swag of the Blue Ridge. We don't even know what that is, but Pete's my swag, so that works. So it is still, what time is it, Pete? 1.05. It's 1.05 and look at this. At least it's not raining. We hiked in rain until noon. till noon and look at the trail this is so sweet right here hopefully it'll stay this way for at least a mile we're going to try to go 12 miles i didn't take a picture of the book yet for you this is pretty cool looking and i did hear a tree branch break and there's no wind out here i told pete keep his eyes open there might be a bear around here I wouldn't second guess a tree branch breaking with all the wind we've had, but there is nothing right now. Nice view, huh? We can't see any of the mountains. I haven't seen anything today, and I'm going to tell you, we, we hit some high elevation. Okay, this day is really beginning to suck, the big one. It's coming down again. We're eating, I'm having a hot tea just to warm my hands up and I have soup in here. Pete's back there, I don't know what he's eating, pemmican or something, but he's gonna have a warm water. This is insane and we still have three more miles to go. If we can get in a shelter tonight, I'm gonna give it a go, but I don't think our trail crosses a road today. Okay, so we started the day right here at Rocky Mountain View, elevation 4,000. That's where we camped. It was freaking insane, but you already saw that on the previous video. And we went to all this. This was straight up. It was crazy till we got to... Right there, deep gap. Deep Gap Shelter. So we went almost 12 miles today, 11 and three quarters. It may have been 12. I didn't turn the map, my walk on immediately. But um, right here, this is this is so steep. It's one mile straight up. And then we're coming down, and I had my first fall. Okay, so I had my first fall today. We're coming back down the mountainside to get to this shelter. And... Uh, just a boulder and it was we were we were walking in rain for how long pete the last it was all day except you know the middle of the day maybe for two hours it let up a little bit it was more just mist but pretty much rain all day yeah so it was really slippery i went down my i hit my knee and my head on a rock but i hit it so gently. she's okay because yeah. she hit her head <laughs> yeah pete said he wouldn't know if there was brain damage or not <laughs> yes you did okay so it's pretty cold tonight. We're in the tent, and I know earlier I said something about um, what I call it. The you said we were try we might get a ride to a shelter. You might yeah. get a ride to a hostel. Yeah, hostel. I'll tell you what. That's but now I'm thinking it's supposed to rain for a week in a row. So what happens? We go to a hostel, and then it's just going to rain again the next day. So we're going to suck it up and see what we can do. We've been in the woods now for six. This will be our sixth night. We have not been in a town or anything. When we did our laundry, that was a mountain outfitter that was actually built on the trail. There was no city or anything there. 
So we are um, going low on our battery on the phone and the battery backup didn't charge at that outfitter. It just stayed at two. So we'll see what happens. I'm hoping we can still film and uh, You may be without updates for a couple of days. Well, we're waiting. We've been trying to upload videos, but we can't until we get in town. So that's why it's taken so long. But once we do get in town, once every six days or something, then we'll upload six videos so you'll have something to do. Anything you want to say, Pete? No. That's it. You would they want need... to watch our videos anyway. <laughs> they need something to do. <laughs> have a good night. We'll talk to you later. Bye.